B53 gives us some show and hide info panels to show info about our presets, our kits, our drums, grooves, and other things. And I got a specific question about this, and the quickest and easiest way for me to show you is to just uh, do a quick video here. So if you want to see info about, say, our presets here, you notice whenever I change my presets, right down here I'm getting some info about it. Location, the preset, the uh, library, and you can show and hide this panel with this button right here. Just click that eye right there, and then you'll have your info about your presets. Okay, so right there is that button there. We'll go ahead and turn that on. Over here to kits, guess what? We have the same eye right there. If I choose some different kits here, and then I can see the content of that kit, I can see you know each of the kit pieces. And of course, the, the location, a bit of a, a picture there too. All right, so that is that info button. Same, you know, same exact place. Come here to drums, same thing. There is your little uh, info button, show and hide. All right, so choose a different kit piece. You get a little bit of uh, information about it there. All right. The same thing is true for our grooves here. Again, the same I button right down here in the corner. If I choose different palette, different groove, turn that on the show hide info panel button there. You can see I get some information, the name, time signature, library, so on and so forth. And even where it's, you know, where it's located. All right, come here to auto. Now I'll have this here, this MIDI log. But if we come over here to our key map, we have this show MIDI log button. So let me hit some keys on my keyboard here. And there you go. Then you have some info for your uh, MIDI right there. Now, if this browser isn't open for you, if it's closed, just, you know, click one of these buttons here. Presets, kits, drums. And to hide this panel, just click on something that you're already on. So we're already on drums. That closes drums. If we're already on presets, that will close the whole browser down. All right, but there's your info buttons uh, for your presets, your kits, your drums, whatever. All right, right there is where you show and hide that info panel. Same exact kind of icon right there. I can get a little bit of information about it. All right, and by the way, if I happen to be on the drums, then I'll see that info down here too. Whenever I change my kit piece, whatever, whatever is activated. Then we have our pie chart, which we can see how much space that's taking up, how much space overall. We could also go to our dashboard and see uh, our memory breakdown there. So there is your show and hide info options here in uh, BFD3. There's a lot of them. You can just go through and just look for that I button. That's pretty much uh, what they all are, except for our key map here, where you'll have your show MIDI log button there. All right, so that is your show and hide info panels here in Expansions BFD3.